in the App Exchange. Soon there'll be 600 apps in the App Exchange. Forbes says the App Exchange was one of the top 10 disruptive technologies of 2006. Pretty cool for our development team. We see this becoming more and more an important area. And uh, a lot of growth happening in the App Exchange. And some hot examples, including vertical response here. And um, companies all over the world. I was in Hong Kong, I'm sure a lot of you know, two weeks ago. I had lunch with David Lee. There he is. He has a company called Edit Grid. For those of you who are watching the App Exchange, one of the really cool things happening on the App Exchange in office productivity, I think they've really got the spreadsheet thing. They nailed it. Better than any spreadsheet I've seen delivered as a service. It's better, definitely better than Excel, but just better than anything else that I've seen out there. Eight guys in Hong Kong wrote it. The whole company is eight guys. That's it. And um, what, what's amazing uh, about them, and oh, we don't have it in here, unfortunately. Somebody took the slide out. Uh, they have, I think, already have had something like 12,000 installations or 10,000 installations. They've got 300 customers sold. They have tremendous momentum on the app exchange. And uh, they're just eight guys in Hong Kong. And that is really the point. The world is flat. Thomas Friedman is right. You can develop anywhere. They're developing as a service. And they're using app exchange for their sales and marketing. It's also happening in India with Thaco, some Compros happening in Mexico with Stakeware. We're going to see a lot more of this.